yeah, Big Don here, Zork of the Ozarks. Uh, I'm glad I didn't make my uh, video on here on changing this alternator. Uh, it took me uh, about four and a half, maybe five hours to get this thing out of here. And it took um, about that long to put it back. There is absolutely no room in there to work. And I've got these big bear paws trying to get in here in this little teeny space. And basically you have to put the, the nut and the bolt and everything in there by feel. You can't see it. You can't see if everything's lined up. And we're talking it was just a nightmare. Now I had um, called up my mechanic and uh, messaged him and he never got back to me. So I decided I was going to do it myself. I was just going to turn it over let him do it. Found out he went on vacation for six weeks. But um, so I said, well, you didn't get the job. So I put it in myself. And uh, but when he came back, um, I went out and I got um, four shocks. Well, I should say struts, four struts. This car's got struts all the way around it. Um, and they had a deal you buy four, get um, $100 back at uh, AutoZone. O'Reilly's had the same thing, around the same price, but no $100 back. So, um, yeah, it was a, an easy one there. So, um, yeah. Okay. So, first of all, we got the alternator here. It was $235.95 with a, well, it says $40 core. It was $43.58 back I got. And um, so, car's got a new alternator. I showed you in that video that um, uh, it wasn't putting out nearly enough. So, then I went over and um, priced the... Um, the shock absorbers, the struts, and uh, first I went to um, O'Reilly's, and they wanted 129, 129, 129, 129 for all of them, and like I said, um, no hundred dollar back on that one. So I went over to AutoZone, get this stupid thing to move, and uh, they were 103, 103. 137 and 137 and my mechanic charged me uh, 330 73 to put them on so um, yeah without you know before I before I got the receipt and everything I figured it out it was a, a right around a 861 88 altogether and like I said I'm getting um a hundred dollars back here from uh, AutoZone um, it's this receipt here. Uh, the four struts were 531 15 And um, like I said, they're going to send me a $100 card I can use in the store. Um, AutoZone card. Not to mention I'll get, um, I got the points on my other card where I'll get um, $20. Uh, you spend over $20 to get points. And so I'll get I'll get those points for that also, but um, yeah, if uh, you get a luxury car, you gotta have luxury payments too. <laughs> this is where I don't agree with Scotty Kilmer. I mean, look, if you buy a Mercedes, if you buy a BMW, you know, you go to your auto parts place, you're not gonna get twenty dollar parts. You're gonna have to pay, and you know. Just like with this car. I knew this car needed them. Right from the get-go, I needed. I knew it needed an alternator, and I knew it needed um, four shocks. Actually, struts. But um, I knew it right from the get-go when I bought this car. Uh, I put on the, the thrust. Uh, I call it a motor mount, but they call it a thrust torque. Torque mount is what they call it. Um, my mechanic did the brakes. I had all the brakes done. Um, you can see nice and shiny in there and uh, I put four new tires on this car and um, 
that's basically what I've done to it so far. And uh, but I plan to keep it. And uh, if you're going to keep something, you you got to take care of it. It's just the way it is. So um, yeah, we're going to work on fixing that dent. I don't. Can you see the dent in there? Had a big old tree limb womp it. And I went to Harbor Freight and I got one of those glue thingies. And I've got suction cups to pull the dent. See if I can do something with that. There's a dent here from that tree branch. Of course, that one. And there's one over here somewhere also on this side. I don't particularly see it right at the moment. Oh, there it is right there. Uh, so, yeah, there's uh, three or four dents in the hood here. From a big old tree limb come womp my car. I got pictures of it on my other phone. But, um, yeah, anyhow, uh, just wanted to make that update because um, I was showing you on the other video there with the, the tester to see that um, it wasn't putting out the correct amperage. And I already knew it. Uh, when I pulled the thing out, the thing was black on the bottom. I mean, it was burnt, 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 burnt. It was bad. And, uh, yeah, but, uh, fixing it up, you know, I was holding back. I was used, trying to save this extra money for a, you know, pickup truck, which I'm trying to buy, still trying to buy one, but I was holding the money back. And finally I just said, you know what, uh, a hundred dollars back, I better jump on it. So I did. And, uh, anyhow, quick video. Thanks for watching. Hit the buttons, uh, like subscribe, share. Appreciate it. It all helps. Uh, we all deal with the uh, with YouTube with the if I can say the word algorithms. There you go. Where some people get you know their videos get shown more than others, but uh, try to make it interesting. Try to keep you uh, the channel going here. Um, I spend a lot of money sometimes. Sometimes I don't. Um, auction sites uh, sometimes you know you have to wait thirty days, two weeks, whatever for a sale to go through so not really exciting per se um but yeah it is what it is till next time zorik of the ozark big don here i'll see you in the next one thank you